jungle called London. It's been such a long time since I've seen so many faces and one wonders what kind of journey they're about to embark upon. As for me, I'm heading to Hammersmith to meet a film director and producer who has chosen to challenge himself by competing in a 48 hour film competition. our film competition has begun and David is typing away to his friends who have decided to help him accomplish the task of finishing an entire film in 48 hours I think he's crazy make a film is challenging enough but to try and make one from start to finish in 48 hours is something I don't think I can do nevertheless on the surface I see David Mastering the art of karaoke and providing old classics and current pop hits to feed an ever-growing and ever-intoxicated public. And at the same time, gathering a team of talented individuals to help tackle the problem of constructing a short film in only 48 hours. But just beneath the dermis, 
Upon my own observation, I see a man who brings people together. And I believe this is his true talent. It is hard to know that you're flying too high until the feathers start dropping. But a man must exceed his reach. Otherwise, what is the point in doing anything? Charlie's here, for people that don't have a line that's good. Emily as well. For the for the direction of the next set scene, Charlie is going to direct you guys, okay? Oh my god. John. John wants to Okay, actually, can we um shoot some ambiance, which means okay. everyone has to be deadpan quiet. I'll, I'll do it more. Make sure you can get as much focus on that as she's no pulling in the envelope and things like that. So we can I'll use slow that down shot. on the Meet John Sparks, a detective that knows the darkness all too well. Meet John Sparks, a detective who knows the darkness all too well. Danny, and this is um, Cameron. <laughs> yeah, okay, come with me, come with me, come with me, come with me, yes. Yeah. This is Phil. Tourist. Okay. Whoa. Thanks for having me. No Thanks for having Of 
the woods. John stumbles upon a twisted plot that threatens to consume Nick's car. Making any film is like assembling a team of talented artists and explaining to them the vision you have that awaits at the summit of a vast mountain. At base camp, you and your team plan out as best as you can how you will conquer the behemoth rock, at the base of which you stand like tiny ants, knowing indefinitely that it's going to cost you and it will cost something from your teammates. One may have the vision, the director. However, the director is wholly dependent on every single person in his or her team to realize that vision. Filmmaking is an art form that reminds us all of our dependence on each other on our shared love of telling stories and the immense power they hold and they have the power to unite people they have the power to realize dreams they have the power to change the world what is art? Andrei Tarkovsky once said this what is art? like a declaration of love the consciousness of our dependence on each other, a confession, an unconscious act that nonetheless reflects the true meaning of life, love and sacrifice. Love is key, sacrifice is key. However, we are all fallible. We all fall short and in the process of pursuing the vision that awaits us at the summit of the mountain, Problems are inevitable. Members of the team will let us down, 
and storms will batter the plans we labor over. Should we hate those who let us down? By no means. In the Bible, John chapter 8 verse 7 says, Let anyone who is without sin be the first to throw a stone at her. Filmmaking will inevitably be filled with moments of bliss and pain, coming from everyone, and I surmise that the true trick of the trade is not judging the mistakes or the ability of any given person, but to be able to assess their heart, passion and true motives, and if they are sincere and filled with love and with a willingness to sacrifice for the vision, then you have struck gold and a collaboration that will endure. Business is business and art is art, but the heart of gold and a selfless mind will conquer both, and it is the fuel that will get you to the summit and back. <laughs>